What's going on everyone? So my Jeremy Lin quarterly box came in the mail this week. So we're gonna unbox this real quick. If you haven't heard of quarterly before, it's a website that partners up with uh, celebrities in different fields, sports, science, fashion, fitness, entertainment. Every quarter or every three months, they'll send you a box uh, with items chosen by that person. It's usually something that's personal to them. Uh, maybe something they use themselves on a day-to-day -day basis, something that they find inspiring perhaps. Sometimes it's memorabilia. The Jeremy Lin box costs $75, which is a little bit on the pricier side, but the money, according to the website, goes to his foundation. So I like that I can help a good cause, so I'm cool with that. Um, plus I'm a big Jeremy Lin fan for obvious reasons. I'm a Nick fan. What were you thinking? Not everything has to be about race, okay? But yeah, it's another reason why I like them too. All right, let's see what we're rocking with today. So usually these boxes come with a, a letter, so the athlete or the celebrity sort of explains themselves. Okay, I'm gonna take you on a tour of my favorite childhood things. So this package is my childhood package, just for context. As a kid, I was extremely loud. I sucked my thumb until I was 11. I cried before school every day until my little brother scolded me one day. I always got in trouble. See, see Asian kids aren't always well behaved, okay? We got Haribo dinosaur gummy candy. I've actually never heard of this before. Of course, I had to throw in some Haribo gummies because they're my favorite candy. Okay. There's also a mini basketball hoop. Oh, snap. You got the JL Jeremy Lin emblem. Okay. You know what? I want to put this to use right now. Drives on him. Inside. Lays, flips it up. Chandler keeps it alive. Lin has to put it up. Bang! A three-pointer as the shot clock expired. Wait a minute. My tongue's not blue. What is this? This looks like a looks like a class picture or something. <laughs> Another item is my awesome yearbook photo where I'm rocking my AAU team jackets. I think I'm gonna put this picture in my wallet and uh, show it to people and tell them that's my kid. See what happens. <laughs> Isn't it? Wouldn't it be weird just to have someone's kid photo hanging out in your apartment? That's just that is a little weird. So I'll put it in my wallet instead. We got a keychain, a Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles keychain. I could actually use this. My beloved Leonardo keychain. When Super Nintendo came out, my favorite game was Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles. What? <laughs> what is this? Oh my God. It's a, it's a Brooklyn Nets spatula. Dude, it's actually kind of heavy too. I don't, I don't know, if should I cook with this or should I? try to ward off muggers with this. Another favorite pastime we had was barbecues in the backyard. Believe it or not, we love eating barbecue quails. Might be an Asian thing. So that's what the Nets Sportula is for. <laughs> it's a Sportula. <laughs> we got a little Calvin and Hobbes comic, little comic strip here. My brothers and I loved reading Calvin and Hobbes. Looks like this is the last thing here. We got a, got a, Jeremy Lin headband or JL7 headband. Another animation we loved watching when we got older was Naruto, hence the headband. Okay, guess I could use that too. Okay, so that does it for the Jeremy Lin quarterly box. Thanks for watching. And no, they are not paying me for this, but maybe they should. All right, from Woo to you, I'm out. Keep your